you're vegan. Mm -hmm. How long have you been vegan for at this point? Probably touching a year now. Mm. Yeah, probably touching a year. What led you into that? Because at first, like, I would get a lot of inflammation, and I was wondering, like, where would it come from? And I kind of researched into it, and it's processed food, and I started getting more into it and realizing, like, the stuff that they were adding into the food and stuff. So I was like, fuck that shit. I'm trying to live to see 100 years old. When you say inflammation, somebody may have heard that term but doesn't know exactly what that is. Can you describe that a little bit more further? So, like, I'll just wake up and eat red meat or a burger or something, and my arm will start hurting. I'm like, what the fuck? Oh, wow. Yeah. And, like, when I stop, like, I don't have no problems, no pain. Was it the same arm all the time? Is it uh, different parts yeah, of your it body? Yeah, it would be different parts of my body. My arm, my leg, my back, something would, like, be aching. I would like, this is something you've read about and researched or something brought it to you, somebody had mentioned it to you and brought it to your attention? No, I, I felt the pain and then I started researching it. Like, what is the problem? Because whenever I have a problem, I just look to Google or I look and see what the fuck is going on. Because I don't like doctors, I don't like hospitals, so I wouldn't go to the hospital at all. When it comes to becoming vegan, some people can flip the switch, so to speak. Mm -hmm. and do it right away. Others, it's a slow progression, taking certain things out over time, and then yeah. eventually they become vegan. So yeah. they may take out red meat, or they may take out pork, and then they uh, just do seafood. Yeah. And that's pescatarian. And then they take that out, and then right. they become vegetarian. And then they right. take dairy and all anything animal-related. Right. Then they become vegan. Right. Oh, what was it like for you? How'd you go yeah, about doing it? I had to step into it. I had to take red meat out, and then I took pork out, and then I took chicken out and seafood. I eat seafood from time to time, and no lie, sometimes I'll eat some wings, but that's it. We're talking about right now, or you're talking about the actual progression? Like when you... progression, Oh, yes. okay, okay. Now, um, how long do you think that progression took before you actually became full vegan a year i see yeah was that easy or hard for you to do it was easy for me to do personally because i wanted it to be healthy so i had to do what i had to do it wasn't like everybody it was pressure like you ain't gonna eat that are you getting small and all that shit but i was like fuck it some people do lose weight i lost a lot of weight how much weight I was like 140. I'm probably like 110 now. 30 pounds. Yeah. You being in the modeling industry, that can be tough. Mm -hmm. Where did you notice you lost the weight at? Mm, mostly my lower body because my top always been small. So. I see. Yeah. Uh, for some people, losing weight is a great thing. Mm -hmm. For you, not so great. Um, it's not that it's not so great. I liked that the way it looked it nice on me, but I like this too, so mm. whatever. Uh, since you have switched, no more inflammation? No. Any other things you noticed? Uh, yeah, I'd be more active, more energetic, and actually it gives me a more positive mind. I don't know if a lot of people believe it or not, but it also helps your mind. Did you have a support system with this? Were there other family members that were vegan, other no. friends? No, nobody, just me. Solo mission. Solo, everybody eating. Since you have made the switch, have others around you made the switch too or no? Not the switch, but they eat kind of more healthier. They'd be like, pass me, like my mama, she'd be like, give me some salad. I ain't never seen her eat a salad this day in her life and when I did that. She, yeah. Have you tried to convince others to <laughs> yeah. eat vegan and, mm -hmm. and uh, embrace that? All the time. What about relapsing? Okay, when you became full vegan, did you relapse? Sometimes. Not on pork. Like, I haven't ate pork in, since I started, but probably shrimp or seafood or something. Because I love seafood. I see. Um, but pork stinks to me now, like beef, it just smells bad, period. Mm. 
somebody watching this and maybe they're thinking about uh, becoming vegan, uh, any advice, any advice for somebody that's thinking about it? Maybe on, should I do it, should I not? Reasons could be different for everybody. Mm -hmm. Circumstances could be different for everybody, but somebody thinking about it. Uh, anything you recommend, any advice there? Get money tunnel vision through my third eye. The third eye opens whenever you eat more healthy. So you'll have a more focused on whatever you want to do. Brighter outlook.